When I first went to church, like I was, I heard the gospel of the Holy of Jesus Christ. And I'm done. I'm done. Me and my mom together only us been through a lot. And when we came up to a point where she met Chris and they had a baby and we lost it, it was really hard. We got through. I was involved in a lot of drugs and a lot of around a lot of bad people who would influence me to do it. I want to change my life because I have a son now and I don't want him to see me growing up the wrong way. I want him to see me growing up and being forgotten. I want him to be forgotten. I did it for myself and my family and my fiance with everything she's gone through. God's been there for me. I've had seven strokes. I've had five open chest operations and I should have been handicapped. I shouldn't have been able to walk. I shouldn't be able to talk. I shouldn't be able to do a lot of things. And he was there for me and brought me back to my normal self. Now I've been going through a lot of troubles and this and that. I put my faith in God and this is what I feel that this is the step that will help me get through. I was facing about 10 years in prison. Two weeks after I came here and accepted God into my life, two gun charges got dropped and now the maximum sentence is looking like four years. I'm hoping for the best and expecting the worst, but it's in God's hands. I really wanted to uh, make my home uh, a better place and lead by example and you know not live in sin anymore. And I wanted to you know, marry my fiance and uh, wash away my sins and start a brand new chapter. And I want to thank God for taking all my addictions away from me and making me a new man of Christ. Before I was saved, I remember um, during the week, I couldn't wait for the weekend just to go out and party. And when I was saved, when I accepted Jesus Christ, I looked forward to coming to church. About February 21st of this year, I lost my seven-month-old son to meningitis. The pain is unbearable for any parent to lose a child. It can take a toll on anybody's life. But when you just give up and you just give everything over to Jesus and you ask him to just take over the things that he can make you feel is amazing before I was saved I was a whole mess of things but I'm a new woman in Christ and I got baptized today because I believe in God and I believe that God will change my life and if he's changing me with the way I feel about myself and the way I've been thinking about life he most certainly can change you